Welcome back to Code Reviews. In this quick episode, we're going to make a minor tweak to improve on a previous video. So in a previous video, we had, ang we had integrated our Angular web app with our backend Spring Boot API health check. You may recall that the way the application worked, the front end is running, the back end is not running. And the way the application worked is that we would report based on the health status that we got from the API. So since the back end's not running, the front end's reporting that it's not healthy. If we start the back end and we go back to Angular and we manually refresh the page, it'll show that the status is up. Now the problem here is that we're manually refreshing the page. Obviously it would be nice if this data could update behind the scenes. The way we are going to do that is with a really small code change. So the coexisting code we have here is just setting this observable variable to the API that is triggered every time we manually refresh the page. If we comment this out and we use auto polling, we're going to create an auto refresh rate in milliseconds value. And then we're going to set that same observable variable. We're going to set it to an interval. So it's going to wait two seconds, 2000 milliseconds. And then we're going to use a switch map which you can look at here. It's basically uh, switches to a new observable, so it'll pull every two seconds, and when it gets a new response, it'll cancel the other one, even if it's pending. So that's really nice. It's This is exactly when you should use a switch map for something like a health check. So it's going to automatically call that same API every two seconds, and every new call will cancel all previous calls, so there's only a, one call ever live. And so we'll save this and our full stack repo will automatically change. We'll kill this, we'll go back and it changed not healthy, but I didn't change anything. We'll turn the, uh, the backend server back up and it'll automatically show up. And if you wanna see what it's doing, you can look and see in the console, go to the network tab and you can see that every two minutes in the background, it's pinging the health check. Or two seconds, rather, sorry. But you can modify this, and it's just always pinging. Uh, it's called polling, it's automatic, it looks much better for the user, it's not a hard refresh of the page, it uses the RxJS library and observables, and it's just a nice big improvement that we've made that I wanted to share with you. So I hope you found this video helpful. Uh, as always, the code will be linked in the video. Thanks.